What's up guys, this is Werewolf LG and I am back for another video. So today we're going to be continuing our adventures in the Final Power Level Warrior, so let's get going. So I got a couple comments on the last video to do the Saga um, playthrough, which I will be doing. Uh, but I also got a couple comments saying that this update was very confusing. Uh, I agree. Um, so let me kind of break it down for you. Training. Let's go in there, because that was the most confusing thing for me. So you, when you log in the first time, you will get, um, like if you watch an ad, you'll get like a thousand, uh, like crystals plus like 50 power points, you know, stuff like that. Um, every time that you log in for the first time, I believe, um, so if I go to ranking, Oh yeah, oh, I don't have my internet on, so I can't tell. But basically, after logging in for the first time, I think after a while, like every day, you get this big boost of like crystals and power points um, by watching an ad. So if you do that, that's for the training mode, I'm assuming. And what you can do is once you have enough crystals, so say if I wanted to train, uh, I train with Rosado. So say if I wanted to train with Rosado. It's a one-time deal, so it costs 2,532 um, crystals once, and then you have to get that amount of crystals again to train with them. Which, I understand why they did that. That's because it's at the level that you are, so 512, which is um, going to be big. You know, it's going to give you a big XP boost. So I kind of understand why they did that, but at the same time for me, I don't know, I would like it if we unlock the characters and then we got to play with them, uh, like training wise, you know, but they just have higher crystal cost or something like that. Either way. So yeah, you buy them once, you get to train with them once, and then you have to buy the crystals again to train with them again. Ranking, um, to my knowledge, ranking, there's no really like reward for ranking down I haven't seen one yet then again I haven't ranked down yet so if there is one please comment that down below and it basically works like it did last time except this time instead of getting rewards when you rank down the rewards are just given through out the uh, rank and also the enemies are like a thousand times weaker sagas uh, I've been playing this a little bit here not too too much and it seems as though it's like Power Level Warrior 2. You play through the saga, there's side missions, and so on and so forth. And you can unlock everything in the game that you need, all the transformations, everything else, by playing the side missions. So, or by playing the saga. Uh, I don't know how many there are. I've seen like people saying there's like 10 or 9. But, uh, yeah. So, I'm going to go ahead and play sagas for this uh, episode here. So let's get into this. I got to the royal family, so I got the rice siblings out of the way, which is basically just rice that risotto and um, rice. Uh, just those were the bosses, and the royal family. I'm assuming will have the princes and the mad king. I love this stage. It's all I'm gonna need. That was a solid miss. Nice. I didn't even need that, technically. But I'll take it. Alright, let's go on to three. So as you can see, crystals are given throughout the levels now. I'll be going ahead and doing the side missions as well since I'm very powerful and like I can get these missions done with no time at all. Do you guys have transformations yet? No, okay. Do you have a transformation yet? No, okay. Alright, let's keep going. Ooh, that's a boss battle. The bigger purple ones are boss battles, if you guys don't know. 
Oh wait, you have a transformation, don't you? Nice. I'm here. Just trying to hit it and just wouldn't hit at all. It's always great. Nope. Going on to four. Alright. Okay. Um, comment down below, guys, if you guys want me to skip these sagas or not. Um, I know, you know, I kind of like playing the entire game, getting the full experience. But, if you guys think that this is just boring me one-shotting everything, then let me know. I'll get to a saga that's actually hard for me, and then play on that one. I can hope that I will find a saga that's actually hard for me. Quite a bit more of the saga, actually. Oh man. Didn't realize how big the saga was. Alright, seven. Love that intro. Too bad I'm only gonna be hearing it for about five seconds. So yeah, like I said, if you guys really just want me to skip the, the like, parts where I can just one-shot everything, get to a saga that's actually hard, please tell me. Because, I don't know, I don't find this fun. To, to make a video of me just one-shotting everything and not even have to transform any struggle or anything. So. The crystals that I missed up here. Yeah. On to 10. Boss battle time. Ah, power level warrior 2. Alright, and that was that. On to 11. Clean sweep, guys. I already know what I'm going to name this video. <laughs> and it's funny, I'm just getting even more powerful, even though I don't need to. Look at the water in the background. I don't know if you guys saw that, but it was just like jiggling around. That's funny. Six. 
so hard, guys. Whoa. Oh, man. I'm too powerful. Fifteen boss battle. I like the stage a lot too. All right, Prince Art, please transform. Oh man. <laughs> I prayed, guys. I prayed. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen boss battle. Probably Prince Eon. Oh, well, oh, I forgot about her. Kind of hard to. It's kind of hard not to forget about her when she's dead, though. 18 slash one. Prince Eon. Is it Eon? Henchman. Power up at least. Thanks. Nice. Yeah, okay. Let's go on to 19. Transformation. Whoa, guys, they broke 10k. Oh, they still broke 10k. With, uh, being base power. Alright, another boss battle, 21. This King Mad. Now Prince Eon. I think King Mad is the last, last one, right? Yeah. No, shit. There's still more? Oh my gosh. Such a long saga. Slash one is this Prince or King Mad? Nope, Prince Art and probably Prince Leon. Alright. Alright, cool. Alright, twenty three. Alright, last. 
last one, 25. Let's level up because we're going to need it, guys. We're really going to need it to level up. <laughs> okay. Yes, I broke 10 mil for my base power. I'm happy about that. Alright. Done. Big boss battle defeated. Threats from the shadows. Uh, bullet, there is two Ds. Letting you know. Threat from the shadows. What character could that be about? I don't know. Well, guys, I think that's going to actually end this video. So, please comment down below. Um, if you guys, I had this thought as well. If you guys want me to do, like, a different character where I'm not a god and I can't just blow through crap. Um, you know, that's actually going to be a challenge for me. If you want me to do, like, rice, like, here, I'll show you who I have. That's not incredibly strong. So, people that I have. So, I have Carrot, obviously. I have Rosado, who is third awakening god. Suno, she's level two. 96, I'm pretty sure that he'd still probably be too powerful. Uh, Rice, I could do Rice. Mirazato, I think, is still too powerful at this moment. Um, and then Rice Set is level 1, and so is Prince Eon and Prince Art. And Sickle? When did I get Sickle and King Mad? Wait, when did I get all these guys? Wait, are these all just... Oh. They're all just open now. So, yeah, if you guys want me to do a video where I'm just a new character and, like, going through, like, the battles and everything, you know, please comment that down below. Um, also, comment down below if you guys want to see me do, like, ranked with my other characters. Basically, just see, you know, kind, kind of what do you guys want. Do you want me to switch up characters and stuff and not just stay as gods, basically? Um, but anyway, guys, that's going to be the end of the video, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like and comment down below. Please answer the questions that I pose to you, and, uh, yeah, this has been WerewolfLG, and I am tuning out, so see you guys later.